Hey guys, welcome back once again to my YouTube channel. Today, we are going to be playing some more Star Stable, as you can see. I have not been uploading on any of my channels. Because A, because of the craziness of homeschooling type stuff we have to do. Due to our recent school closings. But anyway, I have now going to be, now, now I'm here, I'm going to upload this video, and we're going to record it. Which we're doing right now. I don't know why I'm still talking. Let's get started. Alright, so this is what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be buying the new Yorvik Wild Horses. I have 7,081 star coins. So you have plenty of money to buy both of the pets. So yeah, let's go. Let's read a little bit about this. Lunar circles, lunar cycles on your are an agonema, but on the special okay, but on special occasions that a new moon brings darkness onto the land. The Inky Yuland Knight lures out a graceful horse known as Umbra, referring to a stick of the to stick to the shadow of thick forest. Umbra, Umbre, on the Umbra, finds it home, finds it, finds its home in the thicker, thicket, favoring the faint glow of the fiery, fireflying light to guide their way through the fire, through the woodlands. Due to its fiery mane, Umbre, Umbre, um, Umbra, has a body temperature much higher than other horses and is always eager to break into a gallop race after the stars in the night sky. Jorvegian, Jorvegian legend claims that a brooding magic horse is used to used to skulk I don't know, around the far side of the moon until one day the fires of Gar Garnock Fury caught its curiosity. The mythical horse fell from the moon into the bumble, bubbly volcano, setting its mane to a blaze. And it is said, said the Umbra that wandered Yorvik are, are descendants of the mythical creature, and that to this day they gaze longingly at the moon they can never return to. Like other, like other magic horses in Yorvik, Umbra shows its true colors in wild places and will con console its appearance in popular, popular areas whenever it, in its magical form or disguise to blend in with other horses. Umbra, Umbra rides to, like the Andalusian horse, the Andalusian in it shares ancestry with. Alright. Let's pick out a name. This is name you asked. I'm just gonna this process up. <music> All right, I'm gonna go with Dark Fire. Congratulations, your new fine horse will be delivered to your home stable. You will find it in a tone box in your stable. Good luck with your new horse. Yay! We're gonna buy the cat that goes along with it. <laughs> Alright, let's read about this one. Alright, Lunar Cycles on the Yorvegian. On <laughs> Lunar cycles on Yorvik are an egema, but on the special occasions, the full moon beams down on the land and the illuminating glows draw out a graceful horse known as Alea. Alea? Yeah, Alea. I'm going to say Alea. Solitary, solitary by nature, Alea sticks to the untamed wilderness of northern Yorvik and, be, and beyond, seeking the brilliant northern lights that sway across the sky in a multiple multitude of blues, pinks, and purples, 
much like a lot Alea's magical coat. Despite their shy, their shy demeanor, Alea, Alea are fiercely protected of protected of the people animals they bond with. Perhaps to fault, expect some jealousy in your stable if you decide to take up take home this steed fast beauty. Your baking and legends legend claims that a radiant radiant magical horse used to used to circle the ring of light around the moon, watching over the people of Yorvik until the day the the day the being alight to earth to save their dear friend who had fallen into the fires of Garnock's fury. It is said that Alea that wandered Yorvik are descendants from this mythical creature, still seeking to find their lost friend. Like other magic horses in Yorvik, Alea shows its true colors in wild places and will conceal its appearance in populated areas whenever in its magical form or disguise to blend. The other horses, Alea rides just like the Andalusians, it shares with it shares in ancestry. Charm, perfect. Crystal charm. It goes along with it. Carry on, talk to me. All right, so we bought everything, and now we're going to go. So now we're going to go back and pick up the pet horses, and we're going to go get them some tack. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to turn your post notifications on so you guys want to know about my next video. Bye!